something about Sydney Sweeney, but on advice of counsel, I have been given a restraining order. Whatever that is. So I'm not allowed to say anything. So I'm just gonna let you imagine what I'm thinking. <laughs> <laughs> I'm spending the rest of my life in federal prison. Okay, Willamont, Atlanta, Falcons season. Take a look at your team captain. If you missed the season opener, here's the TLDR. It's Atlanta Falcons season. Our team captain is Gold 99, Ring of Honor, Michael Vick. And I'm not gonna lie, his season debut wasn't that amazing. The man who had the greatest season debut you'll probably ever see is this guy right here, Saquon's Barkley. Saquon very casually had 10 rushes for 150. 53 yards. And not only that, we had a nail biter. High ball game going down to the final few minutes. So if you missed it, make sure you check it out. And when you're done, you can catch me right here. I'm not going anywhere. Dude, it's youtube.com. I'm not going anywhere. We prestige Jason Kelsey from last season and he proved to be absolutely dominant with his Vanguard ability. If you guys weren't aware, the Kelsey tribute card has Vanguard. It's not an X factor. You don't have to activate it. He just has it at all times. And it was hysterical. He had seven pancake blocks and he paved the way. We got some like decent budget wide receivers. I'm still looking for a true wide receiver one, but we've got Prestige Jamar. We've got Zay Jones. We've got Randy Moss, Tyreek Kill, and Jalen Waddle. Still rocking a silver fullback, a silver right guard, and a budget left guard, and kind of a budget right tackle, budget backup tight end, but we'll get there. Now, defensively, we're rocking two silver outside linebackers. That's never fun. We did pick up Malik Hooker, who's a good fill in right now, but he did get torched last game. So I'm kind of on, I'm kind of on hooker watch right now. I don't know. I'm just looking out for a hooker. I just really would like a hooker. I, I desperately need. I, although one thing I will say about this wheel on my team, the corners are nuts. PS2, Jalen Ramsey, D'Angelo Hall, who is, by the way, boosted by Michael Vick up to a 99. So these are some nasty corners. D-line is great too, but I noticed something last game. Jalen Carter was playing edge rusher. It's because my rush right end is Jalen Carter. So I got to switch this for Jonah Williams because I want to make sure that Jalen Carter is always in the interior since he has inside stuff. So that's now how it should be. So we're 1-0 to start the season. We've got three wheel spins to add to this team. Let's patch up some of these holes, gentlemen, and, and make another push for the Super Bowl. You know, some seasons you have all amazing games, and some seasons it's all rage quits. This first game was insane. I'm hoping it stays like that the whole season. As we get a position jackpot, it's going to be really important that this is a position we need. Yeah, that was probably the most obvious thing I could have said there. Great commentary, Matt. But in all reality, I have homeless people in some positions and absolute God Squad players in others, so this has got to be something usable. That's okay. It is okay. I mean, I do have Taylor Moten right now at right tackle, but here's what we can do. I can take Taylor Moten out of right tackle. I can move him to right guard where he's an 88 overall, pretty big decrease, but still solid. And we can go pick up any right tackle we want. So there's no gold 99 right tackles in the game as I record this. There's two options, Jackie Slater or Dan Deardorff, both pass protectors. The only difference is going to be abilities. So I'm going to go on mud.gg and see who we like better. So Deardorff gets secure protector for one AP. Jackie Slater gets secure protector for one AP. They're basically the same card. Now, it looks like Deardorff also gets a zero AP identifier, though. So Deardorff is marginally better. We're gonna rock Dan Deardorff our right tackle. We'll still definitely use Secure Protector. It just costs AP. Once again, I say this every episode, but I like to reiterate, I know some people bounce around. Secure Protector is such an important ability this season. No outsiders and inside stuff make it so hard to run the ball. Secure Protector is the counter to those abilities. It makes it so they don't just rip off you like you're a toddler and then blow up your running back like he's a toddler. So... Secure protector, very essential. And then on top of that, we could rock all day or identifier. I'm gonna rock identifier to free up the AP we were using on Taylor Moten. So it's a swap. We get an awesome right tackle and technically a new right guard out of this. Not bad at all. That was a pretty favorable spin right there. Too bad he's not a gold 99, but hey, he's boosted to a 99. That's an awesome pull right there. All right, beautiful. Deardorff added to the O-line. O-line is looking a lot better. Kelsey Williams, Deardorff, and some budget guards. Our next wheel spin. Ooh. So we'll get our choice out of the top 12, 96 to 97 overall players on the auction house. You got to sort by time remaining and quality 96, 97, and we'll get our pick of the litter. So 96, 97, now sorted by time remaining. Emmett Smith and Aikman 
Both of those are a wash. 96 Waddle. I don't hate that. Outside linebacker Megatron. That would be fun. There's not a single 97 in here. That is so unlucky. Drake London's cool. Woodson's okay. You know what's funny? So like Terrell Suggs is obviously more of a true linebacker than Calvin Johnson is. But dude, Calvin Johnson's a pass coverage. Oh my God, this card's insane. 97 speed, 6'5". Okay, his block shedding isn't great. His tackle isn't great. What's his hit power? Is it okay? Is it in the 90s? Hit power of 98. This card's insane. That's exactly who we're going with. Now, the icing on the cake is if he gets free Lurk Artist, but I don't know if these 96s get any discounted abilities. And maybe they do, I just don't know. He doesn't get a discount on it, but you do get a 1 AP Lurk Artist. Oh my God, my linebackers are Chris Collinsworth, Ray Lewis, and Megatron. Welcome to Madden Ultimate Team, ladies and gentlemen. He's definitely gonna be a starter. And I'll also make him my sub linebacker over Collinsworth. I feel like that makes the most sense because I want to be using him. He's a 97 overall. All right, that leaves only one spot on this whole defense. That's a huge liability. It's, it's really Tavius Robinson, who hopefully we can get a replacement for. But dude, Megatron, I'm so excited to use that card. That's gonna be so fun. That takes us down to our final wheel spin of today's episode. Hoping that we can pick up either, probably another linebacker. Makes the most sense. Ooh, Go Some Mutt. This is not a great spin. This is a bit outdated, but we'll have to make the best out of it. Go Some Mutt choice. So the best cards in Go Some Mutt are 94 overalls. It's really just going to be about getting a position that I have nobody at right now. You know who I actually really like as an option here? Like, shockingly good option here. So, Carmichael is a really good option, but I just got Megatron. Carmichael's cheesy. I see him all the time. I don't want to see him anymore. I'm going to do something weird here. I actually think Larry Allen is an awesome option here. So, Larry Allen, 93 right guard, so he's definitely an upgrade, but he also has a really good pack-a-punch option, too, because he's got an Ultimate Legend, I think, gold 99, maybe 98, but he's already really good. Also, by the way, whoever gave Larry Allen 54 speed, I am personally offended. Everybody has seen the clip of Larry Allen. Larry Allen should have 80 speed. Speed minimum. He gets linchpin for one. I actually could use linchpin. To accommodate linchpin on Larry Allen, I'm taking tank off of Gronk. It was fun. We don't need it. One more reminder. Linchpin says stronger blocking from all offensive linemen. That's not true. It's stronger run blocking from all offensive linemen. Protected, the quarterback ability gives you stronger pass blocking from all offensive linemen. Just wanted to reiterate that point. That takes us to the challenge wheel. Completing the challenge wheel will get us one of any pack we choose or... We could salvage a player in the event we lose. Oh, I have not done this one. Like, I have not completed this in a long time. I've been distributing the wealth. We need a hat trick with one player. Three touchdowns all going to one player. Passing touchdowns do not count. Look at that top three. That embodies Falcon season two. Michael Vick and Hall. He's got a Patriots theme team. Why does Puka Nakua get Patriots cap? Regardless, this is a Patriots theme team. He's got Randy Moss, Puka Nakua, Ojo Cinco. I wonder who he's rocking at quarterback. Retro 942. Who's got Bo Jackson? And is that Jonathan Taylor? Fred Taylor. Fred Taylor back there. Oh my God, you just got blown up. Who was that? Megatron backer is on the D-line. Why are you on the D-line? Whatever, it worked, right? Fred Taylor is going absolutely nowhere. Pat McAfee punter is in. Why is Pat McAfee punter in? Whatever. Get clamped. Get user clamped. Holy cooker. Get the pitch into Derwin. Tell me why Malik Cooker's balling out, though. Ah, uh, yeah, just come on. Let me go Let me go play some real comp. Come on. For anyone confused, when we get a game like that, where somebody throws a pick and just quits, we don't count it. So I'm still 1-0. Same challenge wheel. This is the real deal right here. Ooh, we got a night game. Baby, I love a night game. Big Hall Ramsey. Demario Davis, Jordan Reed, Tyran. A Saints theme team. Oh, and it's another Eagles? Like, dude, you got, you got the Saints theme team. Rock some Saints unis. You're not gonna break that and go. <gasps> yes! He was tackled by my lifeless body. Oh my God, he almost housed that. First and 10. Juke. Yeah! Yeah! You like that helmet in your arsehole? That's how you tackle. Megatron backer. Oh, he is going for the handoff. Go low, Malik. Ooh! Little RPO here. Gotta go Lois Sertan so he can't get blocked to make that awkward for him. He's going with another run. We've got bodies. Oh, no, we don't. Dude. I'm going to hop on Derwin for the stretch. Okay, that's fine. Avalanche, dude. That's a downhill hit stick with an avalanche. He must have tank or something. Maybe he has tank and that negated it. Does Bo have tank? He does. He has tank. Okay. So I don't know if I can get an avalanche hit stick on Bo. I'm going to go on Megatron. I don't think he has anything. And he 
he's got a, a heat-seeking missile on him. You can't throw! Let's go! Ray and Carter combined. Fourth and goal. We're gonna force a field goal. That's huge. That was looking scary. Yeah, whatever happened to all the fake field goals, man? They were they used to be so lethal. I don't see them anymore. All right, so for hat trick touchdown, honestly, I kind of just play this normal. And whoever gets that first touchdown, then we target them after. No reason to try and force it yet, you know? Like, right there is an insane route out of Gronk, and we got a rub. Ooh, that was so nice. 39 yards. I'm already passing better than I passed last game, so that's a good start. Let's see if the corner route's still there. Doesn't need to be. This is a bad ball. Wow, Vic can make some throws. Yeesh. Oh my god, he's there. If I freeform it well enough. Oh, he's on Cam Jordan? That's huge. Right in the middle is going to be Saquon. Thank you. That's why you use Identifier. He's been using a middle linebacker, then he hopped on Kim Jordan for unstoppable force. Now he's back on Demario. Can he get there? <laughs> Saquon, dude, that juke animation is crazy. Saquon might have the best juke animation I've ever seen. All right, first and goal. Who's going to get this? Saquon, free. Hey, 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 ref. He just cooked it. Hey, got to throw that. Let him do that, ref. Going for the fake. The sprint out pass. This is so stupid. I literally have all the points in the world. What's the purple? <gasps> it's money. Oh, it's so money. Eight to three. I told you. Let's go. First and 10. What's he got? Looking for something deep. That's a... I'm on bow here. It's so open. Oh, big hit. He's going to hand this off. Oh, boy. So the hat trick for Saquon is what we're looking for, by the way. I like that a lot. He was such a stud last game. Can we go off with him again? I think this might be a run again. I'm going to pull Jonah Williams over here. It is. Enforcer Supreme. Ooh, good shot. Inside zone right now. You know what's funny, though? He did the same thing last possession. He got all the way down there with some effective running, but then once he got down close, he couldn't convert. So if this can be the same story... Great defense. What a... First and 10, there's a play action. Oh, that got, oh, thank you. Thank you so much, Drew Brees, for missing that pass. I just, dude, I just screamed my safety out of that zone to make a play. I wonder if he runs the same thing. Bench, 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 bench. There are so many late hits in this game. He just went for a jump ball with Tyree Kill. Listen, I like Tyree Kill as much as the next guy. I don't think he's a jump ball guy. I gotta get Ray Lewis, okay. And once again, when he gets in close, he's struggling. Fourth and seven. God, it's an RPO? <gasps> Illegal man downfield. That was a nasty play. That was a nasty RPO. Now you kick the field goal. Because you're not going to catch me off guard with that again. That was a one-time thing. Dollar cover three sky. Yeah, yeah. You just got to quit. That, that sucked so bad. I don't know what happened. I don't know. I'm going for one more. That was too early. OG Big Red for 20? Mahomes? Oh my God. That's a scary team. You know what? This is a duo theme team. This is a Chiefs and Niners theme team. 25 of 25 Chiefs, 25 of 25 Niners. All right. What does he got? Mahomes? Oh, maybe not. Maybe not Niners. This is basically a Chiefs theme team with some extra really good players mixed in. I can't get a grasp on what this is. Oh, oh my God. What a ball. Good defense. He could have got Moss for sure. That would have been scary. We're facing a lot of teams today. He's going to go with the handoff to Derrick Henry, everybody's favorite Kansas City Chief. And he's stoppable on the opening drive, third and four. That's something short. Very unlucky right there. What's he going? Fourth and four. Good ball. He's got the Nigerian nightmare. This might be handoff. What do you know? Cuts it back. Nice cutback. Got to... Uh, Enforcer Supreme. Sorry, Okoye. You know I love you. Second and one, I'd expect to pass here. I don't know, an RPO. But Derrick Henry's bagged. Jonah Williams wants another something short. Oh my God, he caught that. This is a slow offense, but it's working. OG Big Red, slowly but surely moving the rock. I think this could be a run again. Every single first down so far, he's ran the ball. There it is, clockwork, but damn, it doesn't matter. Gotta force a turnover. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. <laughs> Trying with a good tackle. He'll go Kelsey. Yeah. Good. No. That's not Kelsey. It's Brock Bowers. My bad. It's, it's technically on. Oh! RPO! That's why you run Lurk Artist. Oh my goodness. He got all the way down to the 15 and turns the ball over. Now it's our turn, boys. It's our turn to take over here. Oh, that's such a bad ball, man. 
Honestly, I thought he was gonna peel down to Jamar and then that was gonna be open, but I'm thinking too, why would I think so hard? Just hand the, hand the damn ball off to fucking Saquon. Jalen Carter, you couldn't even hand the ball off. We earned Super Bowl rings on defense, not offense. This ain't nothing new, uh-oh. Avalanche, shit. He's got a few things out of this. He's ran it out of this, he's passed it out of this. That's, is that play action? No. He's like really dedicated to the run, but it's getting swallowed up. Jalen Carter's all over it right now. Ooh, get home! Six blitzers, five blockers. I like math, I like it a lot. Did he start with ball? I think he started with ball. So if I can score here and get ball half, we'll be in a good spot. Why not take it out, right? Why not? Oh my God, I have Vanguard Kelsey out there. Yo, did, yo, run that back. Vanguard Kelsey is on my kick return team. He just Vanguard blocked someone. I don't know what this defense is. Okay, but I like it. Mmm, Kronk broke that tackle. I'm going no huddle. I don't know. I just want to try it. Oh, I'm bagged. He almost caught that off the tip. See, that works. If I have a gold 99 wide receiver one, that works. But Jamar's not fast enough to pull that off. So honestly, I'm just lucky we got out of that without anything horrible happening. Second and 10. Let's go to Saquon. Jesus. All right, here we go. Third and 11. I'm running dagger. Gronk looks very open. Ooh, it's a quick one. Huge catch. Super open. Ooh, cheeky little juke animation. Make that first and 10. Wait a minute. This could be a really greasy but excellent shoe clock opportunity. I'm going to try it. I could get all of the clock here and then go into halftime. One second left. We snap and just got fucking nano. Oh my God. I don't know, I don't think I have this. Oh my God, are you kidding me? You don't even jump? Dude, Tyron Matthews like five foot 10, you're six foot five. Not sure that was the throw though. I don't think that was who I was supposed to throw to there. Second and 16, Jalen Carter gets home. I'm blitzing Bosa and Sertan here. This is super weird. Oh my God, please. Henry's bagged. Very questionable. Super Bowl MVP. Super Bowl MVP for a reason, he's still on his feet! Blocks! Blocks! Yeti! Oh my god, Sartan! He's the best, he's the best player I've ever had! I need to like slow down and just look at the defense. What the actual fuck is going on? I'm simply looking at the right side. I said right side, he threw left side. You get the idea. First and 10, we're in range. I don't even think base flex is what I should be running here. I think I put Jamar Chase actually on a hitch here. Yes. The only problem is I don't really have the clock for this. Let's save our last time out, go with the spike. It's 32, 12 seconds left. He is. Dude, can we fucking step in front of the five foot nine guy? Can we step in front of him and catch it on him? You're so much bigger. What are you doing? Oh, dude, I'm aggroing and everything. All right, I'm getting tilted. I got to settle down. Oh, my fucking God. Are you serious? Are you actually fucking serious? EA. My favorite wine is a Riesling. My favorite restaurant is Ocean Prime in Scottsdale, okay? I like the tuna. I like the seared tuna, okay? And I like a starter of the Atlantic King crab, okay? Because I like to be wined and dined before you fuck me. What are we doing? Are you shitting me? An actual Hail Mary DPI into a caught bobble? Let me make something abundantly clear. I'm winning this game. We're winning this game! Sometimes you gotta turn the commentary off and just go lock in and get it putty. That's what we needed right there. Seven of fucking ten. This could be one of a few things. Gotta love that. DJ Reader. 91 DJ Reader gets home. Second and 19. Coach is suggesting mid blitz. I gotta say, I love the play call here. Send him a big boy. I like it. As long as you take him down, I like it. Third and 12. He wants Yeti. Oh, good ball. That's great ball. Can't be mad about that one. The very good news, he scored fast. So this is not my worst nightmare. I just gotta come out here and do it again. Ooh, almost. All right, let's lock right back in. He's gonna leave this again. He's left it all day. I don't know if Gronk has the speed for this. 
I have one touchdown with Vic right now, by the way, and I gotta go hat trick Vic. I'm just gonna take a check down here. Woo! Second and four. Gotta get. I got it. I, the clock is not my friend. Two for Mike Vick. Come on, baby. We can go hat trick. We can go challenge. Will and we can get the win. Give me them all. All right, this is mid blitz. <gasps> that is such a big tackle. Slip screen. Oh my God! And he gets. He doesn't even get it all. Fourth and twenty from the twelve. You gotta punt this. Big boys, big. Jamar Chase is the punt returner. Give me a block. Or don't. Don't need it. I don't need it. No, that was not supposed to be such an aggressive cut. I had a chance. It ain't over till it's over. This is the first time I've seen him switch his defense. Please, you're so much bigger than him. Yeah! That's what it's gotta look like! Out at the one for the hat trick. God, if this bites me in the ass, I'm gonna cry. If this bites me in the ass, I'm gonna cry. What a monster double me play out of Grant. I don't think he can, I mean, technically he can. We slip, flip it left side. Three! Who would have thought the hat trick is a rushing touchdown from Michael Vick? I'm interested to know Michael Vick's PPR stat line after this, but right now we take the four point lead. Oh my God, let's go boys. Stay with me. He's in gun empty to start out. We can guess pass. I'm on 11. He's gonna heave this up. This is interceptable. Megatron linebacker is a beast, but sadly we are just barely out of bounds on that. I don't even wanna watch the replay on that. It's probably gonna make me sick to my stomach. Yes, pass one more time. I'ma hop on Megatron. Can't let him chunk us. I'm looking for a corner route. Oh, a crosser out of Kelsey. Oh no, I just vacated that, but he's got slow momentum. Fourth and two. Michael Pittman's gotta turn that shoulder and get up field. Play action. He's got the deep one. Where? Are we? What was I in? I might have been in a cover too. I don't know, but nice find. Oh my God. I don't know shit. And I just vacated that area. He's not in. He's not in. Come on, boys. I'm guessing run and I'm run committing middle. Derwin James, you, you, slip a, you, you slip a perk 90 instead of a perk 30, Derwin. What the fuck are you staring at, buddy? There's a little LSD in the Gatorade bottle. You're just gonna sit there with your hand on your cock while Patrick Mahomes walks it in? What on God's green earth is Derwin James looking at? I'm so horny. 21 to 24, a field goal takes us into overtime. I think it's in my best interest to chew the clock no matter what I do here. I still want to try Saquon out. <laughs> He's out of energy! This man is the most tired man alive! Saquon never has stamina, but he's insane! Holy shit, you're the greatest running back I've ever seen. These are the greatest moves I've ever made, and you have no stamina! We have to be the arbiter of the win. Hope that makes sense. Always got to be the arbiter of the win. You have to control the win. If I ran that better, it might be a touchdown, but once again, I don't think I want it that soon. He's not using his timeouts. Okay, at this point, you take the touchdown if it's there. Check down to Saquon, knocked out. Good defense. Oh my God. Oh my God! Michael Vick is gonna take four! The Max Protects kept me blockers on the right side and Vic rolls out to the right! Oh my God, I cannot believe it. Four rushing touchdowns, Michael Vick. 28 to 24, nine seconds left. It's weird that he didn't use his timeouts. I get that he's preserving them, but now he has nine seconds for a touchdown. Hey, he did it with three seconds last time. I saw him do it at Hail Mary, so I'm not ruling shit out. Nine seconds for the rest of your life! Please, I need the best coverage of all time. Megatron. Burnt three seconds, got him on the 15. He's gotta go 85 yards. Okay, so last time I ran a, a, a deep zone, absolutely not, I'm not giving him that much time. I'm gonna go nickel two four, cover four palms, and I'm gonna blitz Megatron and Lewis. I'm gonna go deep with Sertan. So I just need them to get home. That's completely fine. Are you smoking dick? I guess he's just making this slightly more manageable. If he gets two Hail Mary touchdowns, I think I'll cry myself to sleep forever and ever and ever and ever, and I'll never stop crying. Second and six. Get home, get home! Yes. Okay, now I just, now I lurk deep, even if he catches it. Yes! Not today, baby! Not today! Not today! And the Falcons, 28 points in the second half? Take home the dub. Holy shit, Michael Vick 
master class. I mean, sort of, I had three interceptions. By the way, can we talk about it? I didn't play that great. I mean, like, my first half was pitiful, all those interceptions, but guess what? I stepped up. 313 yards, three interceptions, yeah, I heard, uh, yeah. But 28 on the ground and four touchdowns. Four Michael Vick rushing touchdowns. Gronk, you're lying. Eight receptions, 247 yards for Gronk. He should have had a touchdown too, but I, I sharked it from him. I sharked it from him. Big OG, big red 420. You have given us one of the best games ever. Thank you so much, sir. Jalen Carter with two sacks and five TFLs. Was definitely our defensive MVP. And our offensive MVP. It's Michael Vick. Look at that scores by quarter. You gotta love that. I was literally losing almost the entire game. Almost the entire game I was losing. I'm interested in the team stats here. So we had more rushing and passing yards. I just had one extra turnover. The really the big difference here is I forced him to kick a field goal one time and I scored a touchdown on all mine, other than the turnovers, obviously. 20 24. Insane game. Final season of Wheel of Mud. The script writers were in their bag. Game one came down to the final seconds. Game two comes down to the final seconds. It's gonna be a great season, boys. I can tell you that. We're 2 and 0 in all men regular seasons. And I think importantly, we get a pack. We complete our challenge room. We got the hat trick and we won the game. I'm gonna stick to the Triumph Elite pack. That thing was big clutch last time. This gives you an 88, a 90, and a 92, and it's all plus. So you get a little bit high. Start with a zero chill. It's not gonna help us. Travis Etienne, get Taylor Rapp, get a campus hero. 88 Bo Jackson. And here's Here's our 92 plus. It is center Ryan Kelly can go at left guard and be better. That's pretty cool. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. You know, <laughs> we're getting so many good pack up punch options. Bo Jackson's actually really good. Bo Jackson has damn near every position on the field. So if I get a pack up punch, I could turn halfback Bo Jackson into a tight end, a corner, a safety, a linebacker, whatever I want. Now, instead of Eric McCoy at left guard, we'll put Ryan Kelly, who's a 92. So that was overall a really solid pack. That goes some mud up there, boys. All right, boys. This season literally could not be off to a better start. I, I need some time to let my voice reset because wow that was a hell of a game uh i love you guys thanks for watching as always i'll see you in the next one peace